Let's move over and talk potentially about the best transfer portal classes in all of NAIA this year. Once again, this recording to our, our according, excuse me, not recording. We're the ones recording. This according to our friends over at uh, Athlinked. And uh, looking at these rankings right here, I'll read a couple of them off just so the, the people at home can get a, a, get a sense. We'll just go top 10 right now because a couple of them have actually changed since the post of this, but the top 10 have stayed uh, largely the same. We got Florida Memorial coming in at number one, Lawrence Tech downstate. How about Southeastern, Carroll out west, Marion, another Midwest squad, Cumberland, Bethel. We've got Warner, Reinhardt, and uh, U Pike. That's our, our top 10 there, if you will. And uh, when you kind of break down, let's look at ex what exactly these guys are, are bringing in. And we can start with Florida Memorial. They're bringing in some, uh, a few guys that uh, have some really good kind of, they're highly rated on this scoring system. One of them was a previous preferred walk on at Oklahoma, a running back. They're bringing into that offensive backfield. So obviously that's going to, you would assume, translate very well to this level. Uh, you'd assume a guy that probably wants to get a few bit more playing time. Bringing in a wide receiver from Hampton that's got a big time rating. They're really excited about him. And a tight end from Lane College, the D2 level and HBCU. So those are some of the additions from Florida Memorial that have them ranked that high. And I think with this too, the net rating of these squads, the way Athlete kind of determines this too, is it's taking those additions. Also, what are you losing, right? And you'll find that these teams at the top are not actually losing a lot, at least to the portal, right? Losing to graduation is a totally different, uh, different peel, different, uh, different deal. Excuse me, different can of worms. But uh, Lawrence Tech, you're bringing in uh, some guys. How about a quarterback from Lafayette? That feels like a big time move, Division One level, coming down to play uh, QB. There, you've got uh, two different couple, actually, maybe three different GLIAC guys making the move down to uh, Lawrence Tech and then uh, running back from Kalamazoo in the MIAA. So a host of guys, once again, coming down a level, probably trying to get a little bit more playing time and uh, and show out on a different stage. So that's exciting stuff for them. They, they've struggled. Like, they've they've realistically struggled. They had a year or two where they were semi-competent. They got a new coaching staff down there and Coach Merchant, who was the head coach of Chippewa Valley. You're probably not familiar with Jim, but it's a big-time Michigan high school oh, football yeah. program. Um, and once again, According to our, our source here, losing one guy in the portal, a tight end. Like, that's uh, bringing in guys is great, but how do you retain guys? And I know Lawrence Tech's not working with a big roster right now because of the new coach, and you probably had a, you know, a pretty good exodus there, but uh, they're working with what they got down there. And then to round things off, down in Florida, Southeastern, they bring in a quarterback from Gannon. They've got a running back from Samford, and then a linebacker from Carson Newman. That's kind of their top trio of some talent that they're bringing in down there. Um, so that's uh, that's some big time stuff. Had a DB and a linebacker leave in the portal, but they uh, they feel pretty good about what they've got. That's the top three. Uh, if you guys want, we can always do some more in depth stuff. I've been I've been toying with the idea of doing like some Twitter Spaces Ooh. or even hopping back in that Discord and doing like some yeah. some calls of that. Actually, like the Twitter Space idea would seem like a, a seems like a fun one to me of like getting like some of that more niche stuff, just getting out there and talking about it. I feel like that'd be cool. But let us know what you'd like to see transfer portal-wise. Are there any deep dives you'd like to see? Any, uh, you know, breakdowns or different teams, rankings, comp compilations, wh whatever it is. Like, let us know. Uh, hopefully, we can help you out with those resources. But, uh... <laughs>